What's up guys, this is Max. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to install ADO Accuracy, my mod for a dance of fire and ice. Um, since it's the first mod, I think, uh, most of you won't have Unity Mod Manager installed. And you'll kind of need to go through the whole setup. So this is just a video tutorial to show you how to do that. Um, the first thing you're going to need is Unity Mod Manager, that's from Nexus Mods, the link will be down in the description. Um, you're going to come here, click on Mirrors, click Dropbox, and then download this. Um, I already have it downloaded, so I don't need to re-download it, but what you're going to do is unzip it, and then um, open it up here. So if you are on the beta version of the game if it says beta right here as of december 1st um you will have to do some extra steps which i'll show you right now but i've requested them to add the beta version um they added the regular version yesterday so if you download it right now it will work with the regular non-beta version but if you do have the beta version you have to follow these steps um, Basically, I'll leave this in the description below as well. You can also find the steps here on the GitHub. But you're going to copy this uh, uh, assembly C sharp ADO base setup level events info. You're going to copy this and then open up the um, Unity Mod Manager config.xml. Uh, you can open it with whatever you want, like Notepad or something. Um, now what you're going to do is scroll down to the bottom or wherever a dance of fire and ice is. And if you are on uh, the beta, this here starting point and UI starting point will both say setup level events info. You need to change it to what's here, ADO startup dot startup. So instead of what was there before, you will just replace these with with this so when you initially download it as of right now until they update it this is what's here and then you have to take this and replace it like this oops replace it so at the end it should say assembly c sharp dll ado startup dot startup and once you do that um, save and you'll open up unity mod manager exe i already have it open um, uh, you're gonna click a dance with fire and ice and then here you'll select wherever the game is installed it should just be like the root folder, so it'll be in Steam Apps Common of wherever you installed it. Um, and then you'll choose assembly for the installation method. So if you do uninstall right now, or if I do uninstall, you'll see it will say uh, install. You're just going to click that, and then that's all you have to do for that. Next, you're going to come to the GitHub, go to the releases, and download this ADO accuracy. 1.1.0. It might be a newer version by the time you're watching this, but it's still going to be the same thing. Uh, you're going to take that and just drag it onto drop zip files here. And that's all you have to do to get it working. Now you can just press play. And this should pop up. If you go to logs, you should see it says loaded one of one mods. And if we go into a level, you can see we have it all showing up. You can move it, change the font size, whatever. Um, minimalist version, save settings, and you can press Control Eight to show the the settings menu, and Control Seven to hide and show the actual things. Um, yeah, so that's how you install and get ADO accuracy running. If this helped you, please give this video a like. And if you have any questions, feel free to hit me up on Discord. Um, if you're in the ADO Discord, it's my name's Max, M-A-C-S. Thanks for watching.